Rub up your engines! Today I'll tell you the truth about the Mazda B3000 pickup. Here's the Mazda emblem. But let's open the driver's door and look inside. What does it say here? Manufactured by Ford Motor Company. Ford Mazda Motor Company. So in other words, this Mazda B3000 is in reality a Ford Ranger pickup truck. Check under the hood. It's only put one of these dumb cold air intakes on it, but it goes to a V6 engine, which is a Ford Vulcan V6 3.0 liter engine. That's why it's called the B3000. It's a three liter engine. Now it's a very conventional engine. It's V6, it's got cast iron block, cast iron head, push rods, and two valves per cylinder. Puts out 140 horsepower, which is enough to move this little pickup truck around. Especially since it's got a standard transmission behind the eight ball here. Now it's a pretty basic pickup truck. Got a decent bed on it. You can haul a reasonable amount of stuff with it. This one has a decent spray on liner. So even though it's getting older, it's solid. You can see the bolts are rusty, but the bed's still in good shape. Now Ford and Mazda have been collaborating for decades. Some like these, the B3000. It's a Ford Ranger with the Ford engine, a Ford transmission. They just had deals going back and forth. Now basically being a Ford Ranger, this was manufactured in the United States. If you were buying this and thinking you were getting a Japanese vehicle, no you aren't. You're getting a Ford Ranger. And they can be decent trucks like this one that served its owners well. It's 17 years old, has 198,000 miles on it. And truth be told on this one, the differential here is starting to wear out. It's starting to growl, which is typical when they get that kind of mileage on them. And the owner's probably going to just drive it until it drops. It might still go quite some time before it finally goes out. Now you could have a full differential rebuild done, which might run you anywhere between eight and nine hundred dollars if you want to fix it. Or if you're more of a gambling man or have luck in junkyards I had a customer a couple of years ago buy a used rear end the whole thing for 250 bucks from a junkyard and the truck he came out of he said it had 15,000 miles was smashed in and it worked perfectly fine even though it says Mazda it's a Ford product so getting parts there's a lot of them out there and you got a lot of choices of what you can do now as a used vehicle these things can be decent you can get them cheap enough and they can last a while but when they were brand new Really, they weren't that much of a deal. To give you an example, the list price of this vehicle was $16,500 when it was new. And at that same time, 2003, you could have picked up a comparable Toyota Tacoma for about $800 less. And yes, the Toyota Tacoma is a much better overall truck in terms of longevity, needing less repairs, a little bit higher technology. But just try finding a good used Toyota Tacoma cheap. That's not an easy thing to do. If you only have a few grand to spend, getting one of these used might be a better idea because you can find them. It's going to cost a lot less than a comparable Tacoma. After all, these are pretty basic vehicles. V6, cast iron block, cast iron head, push rod, simple technology, and they're not bad vehicles. And if you can get one for a cheap enough price used, it can be a great secondary truck for running around with. After all, a small pickup truck is a small pickup truck. They all look the same. They look like small pickup trucks. <laughs> and you can see, 17 years later, body's still in excellent shape. Even the fancy rims that it originally came with are still looking pretty good for all that age. Now, of course, having a V6 engine, even though it's a standard transmission, these aren't gas misers. This particular one gets about 17 in the city and 21 on a highway. You don't get great gas mods with pickup trucks, especially when they're a little bit older. But that's not what you buy pickup trucks for. You buy them to haul stuff. It's got a decent sized bed with a standard transmission. It's pretty easy to haul reasonably heavy loads. And with that V6 engine and a standard transmission, it can tow 4,000 pounds, so it's got towing capability. All in all, it's a decent little pickup truck, especially if you find a good one used at a decent price. Just realize, it's not a Mazda, it's a Ford. It's made by Ford in the United States. So if you were looking at one of these Mazdas and a Ford Ranger pickup truck, realize it's the same thing. <laughs> you could buy either one, you'd be getting the same vehicle. And I gotta admit, this one in red, it's a sharp looking little pickup truck, even though it's 17 years old. So now you know the truth about a Mazda B3000 pickup truck, how it's really 
A Ford Ranger? And not a bad little pickup truck, if you can find one that isn't all worn out yet. So if you never want to miss another one of my new car repair videos, remember to ring that bell.